another little project that I had I just finished installing is these uh, power meters I got two of them 220 amp um, display a lot of great information on here um, currently I'm about 1200 1243 50 1250 watts and uh, it's got a lot of it's got your amps volts it hurts the, the, the power factor uh, down here at the bottom the blue uh, here that's important um, anything above a 0.8 is good I'm almost at a one which is uh, no loss in, uh, in the frequency, meaning that the, everything is wired up properly, everything's working good. Uh, anything below a 0.8 uh, means that you've got some issues in your wiring. Um, but anyway, it's, it's good to have. Uh, I made these, uh, these power meters um, they just come with a with a display. You have to buy the box, the outlet yourself, and and make these cords yourself. Uh, the cord is a is a 12 gauge, and that's as smallest as you can go for a 20 amp. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it's not the greatest work. You can see some little, uh, but I mean they they do the trick. They're hooked up to a surge protector, a 20 amp surge protector, and uh, <clears throat> my two dedicated 20 amp uh, circuits down there. Um, one thing I do have to say, uh, Mr. Wolf did mention the upgrade or the new version of T-Rex, which is awesome. Uh, the latest one. Um, gave me like 23 more hash rate which is awesome uh, I got the same clocks and everything and it just boosted everything up I'm in the 60s now 63 I was in 58 uh, my 30 60s were running at 32 now they're at 36 so yeah I mean it's great so I'm in the 320s now. Uh, I did have to add this small little fan here just to keep my cards a little cooler. I like running around mid 50s on my temperatures. And uh, right now it's the morning. Happy Easter, by the way. Uh, so everything's running a little cooler, but right about three o'clock, the afternoon that's when it's the hottest uh, they get up to about 55 but uh, yeah that's all I have for you guys today